Hello and welcome to You Deserve a Drink. I'm Mamrie Hart and welcome to a special edition of Quick Shots. So, recently, if you don't live under a rock, you may have seen that the Oscars happened. A night full of big stars, big hair, big winners, and even bigger breast implants. So who do I think most deserves a quick shot this week? It's all the losers and winners of the Oscars. So in honor of the Oscars, we're going to be making an Oscars red carpet. So in order to make your Oscars red carpet, here's what you'll need. An ounce of gin, an ounce of vodka, three-fourths ounces of cherry brandy, an ounce of pineapple juice, and an ounce of high C orange soda, and a dash of grenadine. The award for best animation was given to the movie Big Hero 6. I don't know about you, but personally, I've learned that the guys who claim to be big heroes usually wind up around six inches. Add your ounce of vodka, ounce of gin, your cherry brandy, your orange soda and pineapple juice mix, and your grenadine syrup. The imitation game was talked about a lot, starring Benadryl Cummerbund as the gay mathematician Alan Turing. Well, I tell you, get me in a room with Keira Knightley and I'll be Turing gay, if you know what I mean. Then, in your shaker full of ice, mix it up. You gotta shake it if you wanna win that Oscar. After it's been mixed, you can pour out your shot. And there you have it, an Oscar's red carpet. Woo! That could get me on a little golden man. Thank you for watching this episode of You Deserve a Drink. So now make your Oscars red carpet, rewatch this, and take a drink every time I make a terrible Oscars pun. Now I'm off to go thank the Academy. That's a euphemism for pooping. The Best Actor Award was given to Eddie Redmayne for his portrayal of Stephen Hawking in the movie The Theory of Everything. I don't know about you, but I'd sure like to see the red mane going on downstairs, if you know what I mean. The underdog film Whiplash had a great night. If I knew that I could win awards for whipping and lashing, I would have kept my job as the dominatrix. American Sniper was a big hit as well, and I can see why. I could watch Bradley Cooper 6 all day. Around Oscars time, us redheads get a lot of attention, because everyone is looking to be on the red carpet. Everyone always talks about how Leonardo DiCaprio just can't catch a break when it comes to winning an Oscar. Well, Leo, you'll always be number one in my heart. And my heart will go on. I'll never let go, Jack.